Did a series of then uh got one of them pour these down, do percussion work. Then I said I'd make points out of them and uh video that. Well I did this side and I looked over here and, and uh I didn't have my video on. I thought I'd push the play button on down but I didn't so I'm gonna do this side now. now I'm gonna do flaking running this way, I call it parallel flaking and bleak flaking. But anyway, I got a wide notch here. Usually what I do is I use uh, <clears throat> two pads and I cut them on an angle like this. And that way I can run it down an angle. But this one's wore out, so <coughs> it's got such a wide notch in it, it's still got room for them to run on it. But what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna seek my tool Hope you're seeing this. Get around right where you see it. Right there. And I'm pushing, I'm pushing that way. And I hope you can see the Flake patterns, they start to run, they run in this way. I blow my breaker my other air conditioning unit a while ago and uh got an old fan in the window that pulls the dust out it must have shorted out or something because when I turned it on it went smoking and my breaker through and can't get it come back on let's go get another another breaker it's getting hot in here okay we'll do it like this Put some color crayon marks on it. Maybe see the way the pattern's running. It's running this way. Now I'm gonna run them this way on this side. Run the, run the crayon over the fast blower. I'm probably not talking loud enough if you see what's going over. Then I'm gonna do this side one more time. And uh, I'm gonna make a Yuma out of it. And if any of you interested in buying this point, if I don't break it, <laughs> you send me a personal message on my Facebook page, John Tuttle, T-U-T-T-L-E. I'd like to buy that humor point you made. We're gonna make a problem agate basin out of another one. And uh we're gonna flute one and uh do a video on different, different two different techniques of fluting. Actually, it's three. I'm going to do two.
like to do videos the finishing points like this pressure flaking because it's just the same thing for 15 to 20 minutes make watching paint feel but anyway I've had some people ask me to do some I raised that edge up about the last inch here. It was quite low enough. When I say I raised it up, the side I was doing it on, I raised it up. But when I turn it over, it's lower. And that's what I wanted lower. So I should have just said I lowered the, the deal instead of raising it. Might not have confused somebody. When I'm saying raising, I'm talking about doing this here. If, if I'm looking at it here, it's bringing it up. And I talk about this a lot. But when I turn it over, it's down. And that's what you want. You want it down below the center line. See the patterns running on that one this way and on that side this way. And uh, if anybody's interested in it, I'm, on, uh, I'm not going to video this part of making a little Y notch or U notch, I mean, in it because I'm really not that interesting to watch. And like I say, it's just kind of boring to me. But I'm going to dig it out like this the way it needs to be. So I'm going to cut this video off.